Oh, hello. We have uh, old Vienna here. Old vagina. We have molten export here. And Molson. we have this beer here. This beer is from Block 3 Brewing Company in St. Jacobs, Ontario. This is nice. the Sawmill ESB. And it's not very old. This was uh, packaged on September 17th. Nice. So, pretty damn there? new. Right. No, uh, this was brought down by uh, Devin and it oh, was nice. dropped off by Jared. Dropped off yesterday. Excellent. Too. Thanks, Devin. Yes, Thanks, thank you, Jared. Devin. Thank you, Jared. May you have your glass going, Thank you, sir. You went there, didn't you, to do a tour? Yes, it was actually. Wasn't there were big really fire cool there? people. There was a big fire right beside it, yeah, yeah. The, um, the market. And you had these guys at the uh, Albino Rhino Beer Festival, didn't you? Yes, that I most certainly did. There you, you are, did. good sir. Look at that, eh? Oh, look at that ruby. Ru rubiness of it, eh? Yeah, it's a very good looking little beer. Now, ESB is not usually my big thing because I don't find anything extra English special or bitter? Uh, the extra special bitter. But the, it is an English style. I mean, it's a yeah. beautiful color. Beautiful ruby red, like you said. Yeah. Nice off-white head. Like I was saying, though, my, my joke with it is I never find anything extra special or bitter about an ESB. I call it English special butter, but... <laughs> oh, yeah, that smells English. It smells nice to me. Yeah, very bready, very malty. That's what you want. A sweetness, so a readiness, uh, it, the biscuitiness, it's all there. Is this their first one they've ever done? Um, no, I think this, oh, this is, I think, their second ESB. Okay. Maybe their first. Their first or second, I'm not 100% sure. I, I'm mixing up. There's so many new breweries opening up There's now. a couple I've had by Block 3 I've liked, so. Yeah, they have their, their Maple Bush Red, which is really oh, good. Yeah, right, their, right. uh... Their session stout was really good. Their uh, saison is actually one of my one of the saisons I think is the closest to the original style of a saison that is made in Ontario. Uh, they they do the dead now was amazing. Let's try this. Cheers. Their uh, their year anniversary beer wasn't all that much to scream for. It was good, but okay. Soft. Ready, nutty, very soft, smooth. Yep. So exactly what it says. I really like the nutty characteristics to it. You yeah, what I mean? it is. Hazelnut, maybe? No? I don't know. I was going to ask you it's because like you, like you eat more nuts than me. They say, so? They're roasted. <laughs> You gotta roast those nuts. I mean, I I know I know pistachios, I know cashews, almonds, that sort of stuff. All the oh, time. Oh, we were just talking about a type of beer like this, a bitter. That tastes like a hazelnut. It's it's a you know what? I'd buy this again because I like this style of beer. Yep, very soft, very soft mm -hmm. flavors. Even again, nutty qualities, mm -hmm. biscuity qualities on the end, uh, just malty. Multi, slightly bitter, nutty, and uh, dulled down. But what this is, is 5.9% alcohol that you can yep. just sit down and drink all Definitely day. a sessional beer. Definitely. Got a nice flavor to it. Looks good. It's just not a lager, thank God. But yeah, it's great. It's a pup beer. It's a bloody pup That's beer. That's what it is. Um... Again, ESB is not really my thing. I have to give it that, uh, for what it is, I'd probably give it a 7. I could buy this again. Uh, and uh, Block 3 actually sells their bottles at reasonable prices. Yeah. So totally. I could actually jump on it. I could jump on buying it again. But overall, for myself, I'd probably give it a, a 625. Just because, again, ESBs aren't really my thing. But it is a beautiful ESB, regardless of whether or not it's. See, I like ESBs. I think it's. I'd definitely buy this again. Uh. I don't make it to the brewery, and I don't think they sell it. No, it's uh, retail, so it's, a, it's get to the brewery or uh, or a licensee, and that's about it. If I saw this at a pub or something around where the brewery is, I'm sure they supply pubs or restaurants or whatever. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a seven five. Ready. I really enjoyed this. 
Good so stuff, guys. A 7.5 from this man here, a 7 for what it is from me, and a uh, 6.25 for myself, because I could drink it, I'd have no problem drinking it, I just... If I, if I showed up at the brewery, I'd probably buy their Saison or something else before I bought this myself. But this is a very nice drinkable beer. If you get a chance to try it, try it. If you don't get a chance to try it, you're not missing much. It's an ESB. But it is a good ESB. Thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful night. Is it nuts? Thanks.